the mirror? How's it been for you uh, just to kind of come out there? I know you've got Adam, you've got, you know, Jets kind of to feed off. How's it been for you so far in camp? Uh, it's been real good, you know, just in meetings, uh, on the field, just learning from those guys, uh, working out with them, uh, seeing how they work, and then, you know, just following in their footsteps and, you know, shadowing them. It's been real good just learning and taking all the knowledge in, soaking it all up. Has there been anything out here in your first NFL camp that you didn't really expect or that surprised you, or has it been kind of kind of what you expected? Uh, most definitely what I expected. Uh, I mean, it's far less pads usage uh, than college, uh, so uh, being able to come out here and helmet, shoulder pads, get your feet up under you first, and then you know transitioning into, into pads and uh, just going from period to period the way we do, uh, it's been tremendous. So just taking it all in, uh, it's what I expected. I know when you first come here and you got mini camps and everything, you're like playbook, 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 right? Trying to learn everything. Now that you've been here a little bit, what's kind of the speed now for you? Oh, it's still definitely playbook, playbook, playbook. Uh, that's the biggest thing. Uh, you know, it's just so big, so much going in uh, at a fast pace. Uh, so you definitely just got to dive in. And, you know, after, you know, you leave here, you got to go out there, and, you know, study a lot, a lot more than, you know, just what we do in this building. So just studying the plays, getting more in the playbook, and then just coming out here, executing it. You know, repetition is what, you know, make a beast of us all. So just going out there, you know, repping it out, and then coming back in, watching it, uh, fixing your, your errors, and then, you know, not doing it again. So it's definitely playbook, playbook, playbook still. How's Jake been for you the past couple of days? Uh, accurate. <laughs> accurate. You know, everyone always says that when they get there, the quarterbacks are different. The throws are just different, you know, whether you're getting it from Kirk on some reps, if you get in there. What's been the main difference between any NFL quarterback so far? Oh, no, no. They all been accurate, uh, putting it, you know, where it needs to be. So they all been doing a tremendous job. Uh, every, you know, QB that I went with, it's never like, you know, disconnect, uh, uh, disconnection. So just going out there, repping it. Uh, you know, they put it, they put a pass on us. You know, our job is to catch it, not throw it. So, no matter who puts it out there, you know, our job is to just catch it as receivers. That's our job. That's what we get paid to do. So, let's go out there and catch the ball. What have you learned from Keenan McCardo so far? Not both in camp and then dating back earlier this offseason. Uh, you you want to you want to play? You got to work. Uh, he's somebody that's going. You know, you got to go out there. You got to work hard. Uh, do everything you're supposed to do. Do it right, and uh, don't mess up that much. <laughs> What did you, the biggest thing you learned in a program like Iowa that you bring forth? I mean, fans know who you are here, right? Because they love their oh, yeah, Iowa yeah, program. Yeah. So, you know, it's a big program. You're going to bring some fans along with you. But what would you say is the key thing that has translated for you so far? Uh, just working hard, putting your head down, working hard. Uh, you know, just come out here, give it, you know, your best foot forward. And, you know, just continue to work all day, every day. Uh, never take a day off. Never think you're too good. Um, work like you the the last man on the depth chart, and you know eventually it come out. And uh, you know that's just the, been my mentality since college. Uh, just go out there, work hard, and you know it'll show. You see guys, you know, like an Adam Taylor or a Chad Beebe, right? Yeah. Who, who took that to heart and look what they've made. Right? Right. They they all come in. They all work hard. We all work hard as a group. A collective group, uh, you know, nobody takes day, uh, days off, reps off. Uh, you know, Adam being a nine-year starter, he comes out here work like it's his first day on the job, like he's trying to earn a spot. So, you know, that's just the the, the motto throughout the whole room. Uh, you know, come in, show up, ready to work, no matter who you are, where you are. Uh, you know, just go out there, give it your all, and you know, leave it on, leave it out there on the field. Yeah, four rookie wide receivers. What's the like chemistry and the, the friendship like in that group? Oh yeah, we all cool. We all close. Uh, we all came in together. Nobody better than nobody. Uh, we all come out here. We work hard. We study with each other. Uh, when we first got here, we used to do walkthroughs together. You know, outside of what we walk through in the building. Uh, so you know, I would say we real close. Uh, we all talk to each other outside of the building. So we real close. Those are my boys. How would you personally evaluate your first week or so of camp? Uh, it's been good. Uh, you know, just come out learning, uh, getting the knowledge from Adam, Justin, Chad, um, Dan, uh, just being able to, you know, just get our feet wet uh, and just learn from all those guys that, you know, been here doing it for a while. You know, it's been really good. So you're going up against that defense on the other side, right? How's that oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Stack defense, you got, you know, Patrick Peterson, Xavier Woods. Uh, you know, you got Prashad Breeland out there. You know, just being able to go against those guys, Michael Kendricks. And then, you know, especially with going against the Neil Hunter, you know, the offensive line, sometimes we got to block them. You know, it's been tremendous. You know, give all, you know, props to those boys. They're working hard. We're working hard. And it's just, you know, we go out there, offense, defense, whoever win that day, you know, we leave it out there on the field and uh, we get to it, you know, collectively. They're also willing to pull you aside and say, hey, next time try this, right, or this worked, right? Oh, yeah, definitely. You know, when I mess up, 
or I do something good, you know, we all, we, uh, you come back, uh, Adam will tell me, like, what I did wrong or what I did good, do it like that again. Uh, Coach McCardell, he'll tell me, like, that's not how it's supposed to be done. Uh, talk to talk to Jets, uh, talk to Dan, Chad, you know, they do it like, they do it good. Uh, you know, then just watching, you know, the older guys go before me and then just taking what they did and applying it to my game, you know, it's just going out there and just doing it like that. What you've been going through so far, is it kind of unfathomable to think what Jets did last year without all the preamble and not playing three games? Oh. I mean, I I just heard something about like he ain't played like the first three games or something like that. But you know, it's just it's it's, it's a while. Like it, it, he the truth, and uh, you know that just go for the whole room. To be honest, uh, you got guys like Adam, you know, on the other side of him. Uh, it's just it's just crazy, you know, just being in that room with the talent, the talent level, and just being able to you know see how they work, and then just you know taking it in for myself, and you know coming out here and put my best foot forward. Flips a different switch though when you put the pads on. Oh yeah, definitely, definitely. The pads was popping.